now from the Three Rivers Casino Resort Sports Desk, KZI 9 Sports with Brett Taylor. Oregon football will head into the bye week 5-0 and overall and 2-0 and in Pac-12 play. That's what's most important to know because up next for the Ducks, undefeated Washington. The prep for the Huskies is now underway in Eugene. And in our coverage sponsored by Kendall Subaru, KZI 9 Sports reporter Nick Ursini explains how the Ducks are getting ready for this top 10 matchup. Hard to ask for much more if your head coach Dan Lanning and the Ducks through the first month of the season, a perfect 5-0 overall, 2-0 in conference play, and relatively healthy leading into a bye week before a very tough October starts against one of their rivals. Yeah, we're not going into bye week, we're going into work week, right? Uh, our guys know what our goals are, what we have to accomplish, right? And, you know, a lot of their teams are going to relax this week, we're going to get better, right? And. Uh, you know, we start exactly how we expect to start, right? But we're about to go play a real opponent there. Those, those guys are playing good ball. The Huskies are a perfect 5-0 coming off a 31-24 victory over Arizona. Oregon and Washington have played 114 times. UW leads the all-time series lead, 61 wins, 48 losses, and 5 ties. We all remember last season. Bo Nix went out with an injury, came back, but could not lead a comeback as the Huskies defeated the Ducks 37-34 inside Autzen Stadium. I think, you know, it's the most important game because it's the next one. Um, and each, each um, you know, game has a life of its own. Each game, you know, has to be treated like it's the Super Bowl. Um, and, you know, it's a good thing for us that, you know, we can kind of reset with this off week and go, can go into it. Um, you know, fresh and ready to go, but I believe they're in the same boat. So, um, you know, it's going to be an all-out battle. It's going to be an all-out brawl. But Coach Lanning says they will use the bye week to not only prepare for Washington, but the entire month, which also includes Wazoo and Utah. We've adjusted some things, but, you know, we have a plan in place. We'll, we'll work future opponents. We'll work certainly uh, Washington. You know, we got some good teams coming up, so we got to – and then we really got to self-scout ourselves, right? It's time to peel back the layers and figure out, okay, what do we have to do to be a dominant team moving forward? So the Ducks will rest up for the first week of October as they hit their bye week, and then they'll be on the road again come October 14th up in Seattle against Washington. Reporting in Stanford, providing coverage sponsored by Kendall Subaru, I'm Nick Ursini, KZI 9 Sports.